So we're going to go, oh, not on this one. Go into Canvas and we're going to do our um, we're in week four, uh, the way I was numbering weeks. We're going to go to the bell ringer. Remember, these are a good way to accumulate extra credit points. Oh, let me get the student view. And we're going to do these together so you can type them in. So we're going to click on submit assignment. And then I'm going to stand over here inside the pie. So, number one, starches and sugars are which micromolecule? What are they considered? Who knows? Um, no, um, carbohydrates. I'll turn the first the lights off. Can you say, can you guys say that helps us? That help it show up a little better. All right, so that's number one, carbohydrates. Um, number two, macromolecule that is used for contracting muscles. Just think about muscles in general. Protein. Probably the genius one second. Yeah, we're on Monday the twenty fifth, so we're in week four. Also, uh, number three, composed of fatty acids, lipids. Stores our genetic information. Nucleic acids. And what do we call a polymer of proteins? Polymer. Um, and my brain has just went blank. Right. <laughs> Um, um, polypeptide. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> it's probably something. Uh, the second was protein, yes. Polypeptide. All right, get used to hearing peptide as associated with protein. So, one is carbohydrates, two is proteins. Three is lipids, four is nucleic acids, and five is polypeptide. N-U-C-L-E-I-C, and then acids. And what are your number five, Polly? Yes. Peptide. And click submit. And then I'm going to go back to module so we can see sort of the setup. Um, we are going to, well, not be in week three. Well, you we might be. All right, it says here, complete biomolecule chart. So if you were here Thursday, I gave you a paper copy to take home of um, a biomolecule chart. And that was what you were to work on Friday. And I was gonna allow a few minutes today for you to finish it up. So um, Alex, if you wanna do it on paper, I don't know if you got started at home online, um, but here's the paper copy. I'm gonna give us about 
15, maybe 20 minutes to work on this. And then we will um, move on to, did we finish the notes? Yeah. Yeah, you were supposed to finish those at home though, right? Okay, so if you haven't finished um, the notes, um, they were on paper. Caleb, okay, also remember to bring those back. Um, so I can get that in. We may start talking about enzymes. What you need to do, um, so I have two of you that are working on this. If you're at home, you can work on this as well in your, to find it, you can go back to week three for my remote students. It's under Friday the 22nd. And the one thing that um, if you haven't done this in Cami before, you can go down here to add media and go to the G and you can search for images for each of these to put where it says insert a picture. Otherwise, if you're doing it on paper, you're having to draw it out. Okay, and the rest you're typing in. On this one I put up here, I had a typo, so I added the correct thing there. So you're putting what it does, the symbols of the elements that make them up, the monomer, so you can type out the name of the monomer and then put this with the picture, I want kind of a structural picture. The polymer, type what it is. It might be a picture of that polymer. Examples, I tried to put the number of bullets of the number of examples you needed. Some foods, you can find it. And we haven't talked about organelle yet, but this is the part of the cell that deals with it or may make it or is made up of it or something. So you may have to Google search the organelle that maybe makes carbohydrates or the organelle that contains carbohydrates or something like that to find those. So about 15, 20 minutes. So at about 5 to 11, we're going to come back together and see how far you got. So you can ask me questions, those that are here. So I don't know if you want to type it or do it on paper. So you have the option, Alex, okay? All right, so if you will go and click on the grades buttons. Because I exempted, I think I exempted a bunch of stuff for you. But the issue is, um, so in here has an EX, I exempted. But what I would strongly suggest is we're going to have a test and it will include some of that stuff. Um, you may want to go back and look at those videos. But if you will, hold on a minute. Like right past the notes, um, you gave me that. Do me a favor, go in here. When you do it on paper, just go ahead. Um, mm -hmm. Go to the in the, uh, the modules and, and, and notes, and that was from Thursday. And just submit it, even though it's late. And that way, it'll show that you submitted something. Because you can it in to me. So it'll be in the candy and world and things as well. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I'm going to stop the recording for right now, but I'm not going to stop presenting and then I'll pick the recording back up um, when we don't have all this pause here. Ian, if you have a question, you need to let me know, okay?